to join the search for a missing Sumter mom and her son. Sophia Van Dam and her two-year-old son, Mateo, were last seen back in June with family in Beaufort. Well, now the FBI and SLED are joining the search. Ashley Jones is following the story since it broke and has the latest on the search. Well, it's been two months since Sophia Van Dam and her son Mateo have last been seen or heard from. I spoke with family members who tell me that they're not giving up hope just yet. What they told me just a little bit that um, they don't know one way or the other which way this thing's going to go. Word from Sophia Van Dam's mother and Mateo's grandmother almost a month into the two's disappearance. Now, more than two months later, she says she hasn't given up hope. I'm still praying. I'm still hoping. And still searching for answers. Teresa Van Dam says her daughter Sophia called home just days before her and her son disappeared. According to her mother, there had been a fight between Sophia and her boyfriend that lived with her in her Sumter home. She said that she just wanted to come home. She was very upset and crying. WIS found through a Freedom of Information Act request that the Sumter Police Department responded to a domestic call made from the Sumter home on June 4th. Van Dam says after her daughter called home, she spent the next few weeks with her son in Buford at their family home and had plans to move back there. Then on the morning of June 22nd, Teresa Van Dam returned home to find all of Sophia and Mateo's belongings gone. The last time she spoke with her daughter was June 24th via a text saying crazy things she was not she must have been having because of the, the stressors of trying to make a decision on what she needed to do um that and i don't know what, if somebody gave her something but she was saying sort of out, talking out of her mind investigators with the sumter police department say following several welfare calls to the home officers found van dam's car parked outside of her sumter home on june 26th when they went to knock on the door, no one answered. According to an FBI spokesperson, the Beaufort County Sheriff's Office, along with the Sumter Police Department, SLED, and the FBI were in Beaufort in multiple locations on Friday actively looking for leads in the case. And I did reach out to the local FBI office asking if they've been here to Sophia's home in Sumter, but I have not heard back yet. Reporting here in Sumter, I'm Ashley Jones, WIS News 10.